Wednesday to you. I'm meteorologist Cindy Fitzgibbon. Skies bright out there for most of us, although the last of the fog and low cloudiness here on the Cape. This is going to lurk, though, just offshore as we go through the day. And as a sea breeze kicks in, it may try to pull some of those clouds back on in. So I think brighter and warmer this morning in Boston. Once we get past lunchtime, that easterly wind is bringing in the cooler air, may also bring in some cloud cover with temperatures dropping through the afternoon. Different story, though, away from the coast, back to 128, lower 70s, mid 70s here out through Metro West and into Worcester County. Fitchburg may top out in the upper 70s today. You can see Norwood about 76. So West is best if you're looking for sunshine and warmer temperatures today. Tonight we will see an increase in clouds and there could even be a few showers on the Cape. Temperatures overnight in the 40s to around 50 degrees. There is a storm that is working northward here off to our south and east. And although the bulk of it is going to stay offshore, the outer edge of this moisture may actually clip the Cape overnight with a few showers. You can see elsewhere we've got a bit of cloud cover that we'll be waking up to tomorrow morning and then this all pushes away as we get deeper into the morning hours. So any early clouds tomorrow morning give way to developing sunshine. Winds are going to turn more southerly tomorrow. So I think the Cape and the south coast in the 60s. Boston though a little closer to 70 degrees tomorrow with again 70s over the interior. But we're going to watch a front off to the west. This will have some showers associated with it that will get uh, into Worcester County likely by the early evening hours. And then if they hold together we could see a shower before midnight close to the coastline and then the front moves offshore and we're drying things out for Friday, but Friday's going to be a little bit cooler only in the mid 60s for highs. So you'll notice that cool down and it does look like a cool start to the weekend. The front though that comes through tomorrow night is going to start to lift back northward on Saturday. So there may be a period of rain early Saturday with some lingering showers even on into the afternoon, but now it appears this cold front sweeps southward during Mother's Day. So improving weather on Mother's Day Saturday looks like the wettest part of the weekend. And it's not a washout, but showers are likely with temperatures both days in the 60s. So looking a little bit better for mom on Sunday and we're back into the 70s early next week.